Yo, yo, what's good with everybody, man? Let's get shot out. Coming to you with some red gameplay today. Um, we got three days until Madden 24, man. So I just like to say, if you enjoy this content, subscribe. You know, hit a like button, help the channel grow, and we're gonna get into this game. I got the Dallas against the Atlanta. You know, they uh, in much they made it where they took away the 99, so. My team is back bad, even though I've been working on that with that little coin method. I made a cheap, uh, cheap theme team, so I might give you a gameplay of that before it's all over. But, uh, yeah, we're going to set up the run right here and uh, get a pretty good game right there. That's Paula right there. Paula don't play around when it comes to the run, you know. That's what I do like about Paula. I do like a lot of Dallas players like Paula, you know, C.D. Lamb, Michael Parsons. They got a pretty good squad. And uh, I don't like using the Chiefs because, you know, their defense is terrible. Offense is good. Defense, so should have hit them triangles, but we see we had Big Man right there. In that play, you won't see me run a lot because it seemed like he wasn't doing nothing to stop it. So we're going to run that play a lot right there. So, yeah, we're in the red zone, 11 yard, yard line, trying to get this touchdown, so we're going to go back to the run. Not a pass-heavy guy. Get a good game right there. Seven yards out the gate. On the four-yard line now. We're just trying to get this touchdown. We're really not trying to pass it if I don't have to. I'm not going to run it. We're going to run it. Right there, another run, so we're going to go back to it. We only picked up two yards, so we're going to try to punch it in. You get a good stuff right there. Fourth and one. So we already determined to go for it. We're going to try to hit up square right there for the pass. We do that. We get the touchdown. That guy, just his guy just dumbs out. Like, he was running, like, towards the other I, like to towards the other touchdown, like oh. the way the player done out sometimes is like, you know, I don't get mad at you know no slack or nothing. I mean, I don't, I don't uh, discredit them just because I know this is a video game at the end of the day, but some stuff you can't just have. You can't have people done out like that. But either way, we set off for the kickoff. See what this guy has on offense. Try to stop him right there. We did get to stop at the 20. Get set up our... Uh, so, it's a couple. I like that Sam Blitz. I'm going to have to find a different Blitz, but I like that so far. We're going to go for that right away. See how he's playing there. So, go for the run. Get stuff. Lost yards right there. But we do like the cover. The cover for the Blitz right there. I knew that, that was going to be a run again. I just didn't want to give up too much leverage as we get another stop. Lost a down yard. Now, since it's third or 14, I know we got a pass, so we're going to go. So, with this uh, cover right here, I like to set up one man. I should have set up another one man, but this right here, check this out. You see, I was going for a cut just to, like, you know, see who, who can I get on, who's not covered. And the guy cut right into me like that. That pass interference wasn't even on me. Dude cut right in front of me. But that's rare. That's rare when you even see a pass interference on Madden as we blow up that play again. But that's rare when you see a pass interference. But hey, he got that. Kept the drive alive. Would have been fourth down. Now he's trying to move the ball again. He got that good cut right there. I hate that play right there because it looked like everybody is running vertical across the field. And uh, he just cuts in right there and get that big game right there. So a first and 10. That's 46. We're going to try that blitz again. I should have set it up better. I didn't want to play press because I didn't want like no dumb stuff to happen where I give him a touchdown because the guy ran right past me. Sometimes they either just get playing out beat because they press ain't that good against their release or they just dumbs out. 
So we'll go back to the cover right here. He get a good gain up the middle. Now we have it. It seemed like we was doing good at stopping him at first. But now he's just tearing me up down the field. So it seems like ever since that pass in the first play, he's just been tearing me up. Big chunk is now in the yard. So we're going to squeeze that gap together. Now that he's more closer. Watch our shit up. Cut with that man. Now, 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 take that out. The guy literally, 55, literally was sitting in front of him. When the ball got thrown, he like swiped his way way out the play and let the guy like the guy. His guy did not move. Remind you that his guy did not move. 55, the one that moved, this where he could catch that ball. When I try to click on, try to hit the Y button, you know, try to intercept that. But either way, either way, he got the touchdown right there. And uh, now we're back on offense. Seven to seven. This game got real competitive at one point at certain parts of the game. Like, like, because for a second, I'm playing this guy. I'm like, man, this guy ain't that good, man. I think he's getting bailed out. And a lot of times, he really did get bailed out like that play. That should have been a pick. That was a, a clear bailout, man. And, and, and see, let me, let me tell you something real quick. Not just that play. It'd be certain plays like that you would play against people, and they would, like, talk trash right after the play happened. Or, you know, or, or throughout the game when knowing they got bailed out. Like, man, you're going to be a football player. You're going to yeah, keep it real, man. Don't boast on a play where you know for 100% you got bailed out on it. You can't do that, man. And see, those are the people I like to make quick. You know, this guy, he wasn't talking to me or nothing. We had a pretty good game. But it'd be them games where somebody will boast and it will fire me up, man. I'll make their ass quit real fast. But, yeah, so we're going to go to the verse right there. I like to put that zig right there. But, see, he played that. See, I shouldn't even do that because if he was – see, that's why I knew he wasn't that good. Why I thought he wasn't that good because he could have clicked on that guy and tried to pick that off. A lot of people would have clicked on that and picked me off. Right here. So, so right now I'm thinking he's really not that good. So, we're going to go back to that play that I ran because I know he wasn't watching the middle. And that's the thing. So – Right there, I seen CD land wide open, so I had because I'm looking for, uh, I'm looking for that same play up the fit up the middle of the field, but I seen CD land wide open, so we're gonna hurry up right here because I want to get a run off before he can switch up his defense, and as we get the touchdown right there with Elliott, so we in there 14 to uh, seven. So right now we just like we gotta get a stop. I don't think this guy is good on offense. That's what I'm assuming from the gate. That last play, it seemed like he got lucky with a certain stuff. I believe he got lucky with that pass interference and that play where it should have been picked. So we like, yeah, we got this. We just got to get a stop. So we're going to kick the ball off right here. Yeah, man, but we're ready for Madden 24. Like I said, I'm going to be busy, man, Try to get Ray's play. Try to get ultimate team. It probably for the beginning, it probably be more regs than ultimate team because I don't want to just hop in ultimate team with a garbage team, and I'm not gonna be spending too much money. Like you might see a couple of packs open, or you might see me. I might spend a, couple, a little bit of money, but it ain't gonna be like to the point where I can just boast up a team just because I spent some money. So as he's trying to hit me with a big streak right here, now remind you. He just ran that streak right there. That's not going to be the only time he runs a streak. But, yeah, I'm not going to spend too much money. So, off screen or off time, I will be building up my ultimate team, try to get a full uh, Chiefs team team. And that's why I won't be playing too much in the beginning either way because at the beginning, you're going to be dealing with a lot of goals as your thing team unless you just have one of them real hot, like popular uh like, we got a lot of elites out the gates as a Chiefs fan, but, you know, they still going to be outmatched if somebody running like a all-power, you know, team just using all elites in general. If they're going for the overall, not a thing team. So, we will be pretty much behind them out the gate. So, like I said, a lot of regs coming to you in the beginning. And then mix it up with some ultimate team. And we're going to be doing everything, man. We, we're going fully game, man. 
I bring you tips if I got them, you know, and, and I do run uh, solo battles, and I, and I do got some tips on solo battles, I just got to see, is it still the same from when I used to play Madden, as he hit me across the field right there, nobody could, I, man, I probably, well, he don't got no ability, so, you know, that's what really supposed to happen, but sometimes, you know, people will jump that, and you like, how did they jump that, like, you know, but he had to step on me as he run up the middle for a game of four. So anytime they do that and they get a good yardage, I like to close that up and make them think about it. I already know. Going deep once again. This time, picked off. Got that right there. So we off to the races. So now we starting off at the 27 after picking that ball off. I go back to the same play. I'm thinking I got to get a score, make this a two possession game, and then we all in the clear. So whenever something's working, I'm going to go until you stop it. Until you stop it, I'm going to keep on going for it. And I should have hit up X right there. I didn't see that as clear as I see it now at the time, but that was a good read right there. X would have been had a pretty good yardage. So uh, right now, go for that verse looks for the man on the crosser. And uh, square up. Now, I'm lucky he, he high. See, that's what I'm saying. Like, certain times, he would. 95% uh, people picked that off. But it the pass did what it intended to do. Like, get up top. Like, I should have had to high ball everything to get it up top. You see what I'm saying? Like, ball just doesn't be at chest level every single time especially certain angles that as we hit them deep right there touchdown but yeah certainly passes is intended to be higher even though it's not a high ball you get what i'm saying like uh when people make like throws like that when people make that it's coming from a higher angle and coming down doesn't mean a chest level but i feel like a lot of throws that should be like that is chest level where People just picking off crazy stuff, like picking the ball off when it should. I should have had to high ball it just to get that high velocity on there. You know what I'm saying? So now we up uh, to possession. So we feeling good right now. I, I figured this guy wasn't that good. He gonna prove me to be wrong, even though even though I don't, I still I'm gonna put this on record. I still don't think he's that that good. He got a good record. I checked him out. I check out everybody I play just to see what I was going against. Yeah, a good record, I say. A lot of, you know, so. But the thing was, people going to start throwing us some shit, man. And, uh, so, you know, whenever it's time like this, I know you got to go deep. We're just going to play man deep. We're not even going to give you a chance. You know, like I said before, I see people playing cover two and, and cover three when you know they got to go deep. Like, we're just going to put our mans out. So, we at halftime, third quarter. We kicking the ball off. We get ball half. So right now, still not worried about it. You know, feel like we've been playing good so far. We're gonna go. I'm gonna try. To, what I do right here? Okay, we're gonna go base because now we're gonna start playing cover. So, so that's why I went base right there. That's, so now I ain't go for that tight look. And, uh, and this is where, now now, check this out, three people, remember, I'm in the zone, so the, the dark zone is going to drop back with him, I even man him up, three people, and he got that off, man, like, come on, Madden, three, and, and three people, and they played it so terribly, so he's going to try to get a run right here. Looked like a stretch. I don't know if that was a stretch. Nah, that wasn't a stretch, but off tackle. But yeah, he got a good nine yards off the rip. So, but like you said, we still got the lead, so we're not really too much concerned about it, even if you score. Now, in a situation like this, I'm not necessarily concerned if you score, but I want more time off the clock. So right now, I do not get what I want. Too much time. And like, he, he really got down the field too quick. I would have liked to take at least half of the third if he was going to score, but uh, he scored less than a minute, so now it's 14-21. to 21. That's when the game get a little interesting. 
you know, he tells me that he's not out this game yet because I was trying to put him away, try to get one more stop and one more score, and maybe he would have just got out of here. But uh, he, 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 he said, no, we ain't having none of that right now. So he's still fighting. And that's what you want to see. Like I say, play. Now, I ain't going to make it like I don't quit out of games. Like, I'm not going to pretend like. But them is games that got way, way out of hand. Yeah. Man. It, not even out. out. <laughs> My baby's talking right now. Just excuse that. But uh, not even out of hand. It just got to the point where. You just doing a bunch of cheese stuff that I just don't even want to be in the game no more, you know. Like cheesy stuff, everybody know what cheese is. Like when you tell a person they run a cheese play, they act like they're not running a cheese play or they don't know what cheese is. Like you know what cheese play. If you know a specific play that could dumb out a, a defensive player where you just got a wide open streak or something, that's a cheese play. So them them I might leave, but like I said, always play your games because even if you lose, you can always find out how to stop that next time. The key is when you're losing like that to find out, okay, I lost this time, but how can I stop this just in case uh, I run into this again? Or you might run into the same player again. I, I just played this dude in what, three times in a row? That, it wasn't three times exactly in a row, but like two was back to back, and then I played somebody else, and then the next match was him. So in four games, I played him three times. So, so you never know if you might face the same dude. So like, finish out your games as we try to go for the run. Right now, we want to try to take some clock, but we also want to score. And I, I would settle for a three right here too. So. You know, I'm not just trying to go for a touchdown. So we, we thought like, okay, we can get this playoff again. He ain't gonna play it. So Bam right there. Now I thought he was gonna close out way quicker. That's why I jumped and caught that like that. Cause I, I didn't I didn't believe I was gonna have that much space as I did. You know, that was a predetermined thought, like, okay, he's closing in when he really wasn't. So that forced him to drop the ball with that hit when I could just A caught it and, and fell on the ground possession and then bam that happened. So we turned the ball over. He blew me up. You know, got ego right there. I wanted to get that first badly. Now he got the ball back with a chance to score to tie up the game. As he go for that uh stretch again or probably with all tackle, I'm gonna call it stretch. Yeah, it was a stretch right there. So we like running the ball, but you got to watch out for that pass, too. So, I love to man up people, like, when I do play zone, as he just, and nobody plays that, man. Like, I understand that, you know, your DVs, like, once they see it's not a pass, like, they post a close in. And that's why I'm happy they highlighted that in Madden 24. Like, they will start being more smarter, like, once they see a play a couple of times, because you see he running the same play. So once they see a couple, and I does the same stuff. So, but once they see a play a couple of times, they're gonna start closing that out. So that's very good to see right there. So, so yeah, right now I don't want to play no more blitz because I haven't been affected. So we just strictly zone right now, and right there, like slow to play the ball, like. I'm not saying that that should have been a pick because they were slap playing the ball, but at least they could have got a knockout or, you know, erupted, uh, erupted that ball a little more than they did. Has to get the flat right there. I don't know what happened right there. Bad connection. I thought somebody was going to get lagged out right there. But that cover three deep uh, drop, I like to play a lot too, though. So... So he get the touchdown right here. Ties up the game. Fourth quarter, three three fifty five left. So now he put me back in the position where I got a score. Well, well, he could have messed up because. Normally, like, if you leave me about 
two two thirty, the game is over. Like unless like you gonna have to play excellent defense to stop me because I, I don't care when people say some people get mad when people work the clock or you know, go for a field goal at the end. Man, we win we win the game, I'm not trying to cite you in this game. I'm not trying to uh, yeah, I'm not trying to see who is better offense wise, who could do a hundred streaks down the middle of the field, the far side of the field. Like I'm trying to win the game, so you already know what it is. Right now, that's too much clock though. That's almost you could say four minutes is three fifty two. So we're not thinking we could burn this whole clock, but we might can. We just have to see what happens. We but we might. So um Right here, trying to mix it up right here. I haven't ran this play the whole entire game. I know that's the play I like to run on Reds. I haven't ran it the whole game, so I thought it would work. As it did it, he blows me up. Second and 22. Now I'm behind because I don't want to happen. It just happened. I turn the ball over. He scores. So I know I got to do better as we go to that same play. I think this time I did not do no dumb possession catch and jump in the air. So we get the first right there. Like I said, that play been open the whole time. But see, why I like that play is he haven't been playing that guy. But as y'all see, I've been having other guys open. Like uh, the running back right there was wide open. So if they did play that, if he used a play that, I could have just went to him easily. So... If you see a play that you know somebody ain't covering to their max, where you got multiple guys like that open, go ahead and run that, man. doesn't matter. Because you need to know one guy's open. They can't, they can't use the two people, so we're going to go back to that play. Because right now, I'm like, okay, hold on, let this go to two minutes. I'm like, because I know I can get in a field goal range. And I'm going to run that same play. But this time, we I know he's going to play it. So, I'm looking for a triangle. That's the whole point. I'm looking for the running back this time because I know he's going to play it better this time. Because he know the game is on the line. Earlier, he's like, you know, he see the formation. He probably didn't want to play it uh, closely like that. But now I know he is. So, now we're going to let some clock run out. We're going to run the ball. Like I said, I'm trying to win, even though we're not even in field goal range. This ain't much. <laughs> you know, when they had them boosted up players and people were making 60 yarders. No, this ain't this ain't the regs right here. So, we got to get a little bit more closer than what we is. So, like I said, what's, what's worked? Hey, no, no need to fix what worked. So, we're going to go back to it. Like I said, he played it, but you see uh, Zeke Elliott was wide open. My running back, nobody was even on him. So, and all we gotta do, so, oh, I don't even call. See, that's why I messed up because I could have, I should have called a timeout. I thought I could get to the line with at least like 15 seconds or, you know, somewhere around there, but it took way too much time off, so I ended up having to call a timeout. Now I got time for one more play just to get me a little bit closer to the field goal. Because, hey, in real life, y'all know Dallas kicker ain't that good. <laughs> hey, Chief's kicker ain't it? Well, Chief's kicker, he can be good, but he's not good. So, we're going to put it like that. Sometimes good, sometimes not. Dallas kicker, he's sometimes too. So, 51-yard yard, 50 yard, 51 yard field goal to win the game. He's going to ice me. So, let's see what happens right here. But, yeah, man. If y'all enjoy the gameplay, subscribe, hit a like, help this channel grow. And uh, we out here, Matter 24. Let's get it, y'all.